gorgeous outside right now, but there are starting to we're starting to see a few storms develop. So let's take a look outside. A couple of clouds rolling in as well, and we are going to see it get a little darker around here throughout the rest of the afternoon. But temperatures are still going to be fairly warm. Let's take a look at our current temperatures. We're starting off with 78 degrees this afternoon in Denver, 77 in Greeley, 74 out in Burlington, High Country, 66 in Avon. We have 67 in Aspen, 77 degrees over in Grand Junction. So what are we looking at now? Again, we have some rain over in parts of the four corner states, so parts of New Mexico, Arizona, and over into Utah. A little bit for us as well. And looking down into parts of the southeast, some bigger thunderstorms right now in Oklahoma, Texas, and into parts of Arkansas as well. So let's take a look at the de uh, Colorado. We have this area of low pressure that's going to continue to move through, but it is swinging up some moisture our direction. So you'll notice that we have the chance of some showers today and tomorrow with that passing through. Looking at our satellite and radar again, a little bit closer into the state, a couple of thunderstorms in parts of Rio Blanco and Moffett County right now, a little bit close to Steamboat Springs as well. We have some showers developing in the foothills of Boulder and Larimer counties and also a little bit into the high country and some thunderstorms popping up near Colorado Springs right now, a little bit down into parts of our San Juans and also into our southwestern corner. But for the eastern side of the state, we haven't seen too much develop our way just yet, but we could see some a little bit later on today. This will fill in more throughout the afternoon and evening. A couple pops possible here in Denver and after about two, three o'clock today, those could start to fire on up and we may see some of that continue overnight and then by tomorrow morning it should clear out. If you do get a thunderstorm today, don't expect it to be severe, but that doesn't mean it can produce some smaller hail and still some heavier rainfall. Throughout the day tomorrow, by about lunchtime, we have some storms again still starting to fire up in the high country and down into the southwest and some of those could pass through Denver and could bring some heavier rain and even some bigger thunderstorms out on the eastern plains. Talking about precipitation for the month of June, as of right now, it does look like we have about a 33 percent that we are average probability that will be above our normal precipitation. So it may be a little bit more wet out on the eastern plains during the month of June. Temperatures today, we're looking to hit 82 in Denver, 85 in Greeley, 87 over in Ray, close to 90 in Lamar today, 65 in Frisco, 67 degrees in Aspen, 81 degrees over in Grand Junction. Now for your hour by hour forecast, we're in those upper 70s, low 80s throughout the afternoon. And again, after about three, two, three o'clock ish, chance for some thunderstorms to stick around. But by nine, anything left should start to clear out unless you're out on the eastern plains. 54 degrees in Denver tonight, 55 in Boulder, 51 in Greeley, 49 out in Lyman, 44 in Frisco. And for your five-day forecast, we'll be in the low 80s throughout the rest of the week and into the weekend. We'll even warm up more than that, 86 on Sunday. It should be warm and sunny. It's going to be hot this weekend. It's going to feel good to get out and about.